inspire talk I said I was going to give, that was that, which I did by Zoom. Don't know if I inspired anybody, but they had a lot of good questions. I think it went okay. When you start running trails and the weather's like this and the flowers are like this, you start getting that tug back towards ultra running again, running all day. Events are happening again, you know, ultras are happening again, but to train for ultra marathons, one day of the week would be a long to very long to extremely long training run. You know, it's become hours and hours and hours of running, and the rest of the day is just tired and recovering. And I am enjoying uh, spending the weekends with Kim a bit too much, you know, well, too much, you know, doing stuff, climbing, doing whatever we feel like. I'm really enjoying that as well age-old problem want to do too much don't have enough time just keep running just keep running <coughs> flies so the questions uh, after the talk were as much about anatomy and teaching as they were about research which is fine, that's what I'm there, you know it's me, innit? Um, oh, no water there were lots of good questions which is nice um, they were asking about not just yeah, what makes a good researcher what's important about research, how to get involved in research but also what makes a good teacher and that sort of thing and uh, I was reminded that one of the reasons I have these vlogs on the same channel that I'm teaching anatomy is to break down the boundaries, the borders between the teacher and the learner to show that, you know, I'm just a person and you can ask me anything and I feel it's important that the the teacher helps the learner. There isn't this artificial boundary of status or a lab coat or a title in between the teacher and the learner. But I'm one person trying to help other people. And, you know, I'm nothing special. So we can have those conversations that help understanding and learning. And you can ask those questions that you're not sure about and hopefully feel that I'm not being judgmental because that's really important in learning you know, it's safe it's fine certainly when I was at university some teachers had that, some teachers didn't and I guess I'm trying to rail against that a little bit I got more from the teachers that I could speak to more easily, right? It would be good to be able to run all day, wouldn't it? Just think what you'd see, the amount of ground you'd cover. That's a surprise, the, um, the water's gone clear, it's been really murky for ages. Oh, pretty. Um, and it looks like it's getting clear enough for snorkeling, although I know it's very cold still. We got here way too early. That's unusual for us. Tide hasn't gone out yet. Some of the routes up there we could do. There are actually some non-tidal routes up here. But to be honest, we hadn't made any grand plans. It was just a case of <laughs> go outside somewhere and sit by the sea. 
She might just sit by the sea, might not even do any climbing. Yeah.